Mr. Speaker, I see hate. Mr. Speaker, I see bitterness. Mr. Speaker, I see acrimony. Mr. Speaker, I see animosity. And Mr. Speaker, I see a man completely out of control. Completely out of control, Mr. Speaker. That is what I see. And that problem is not a new problem to me, you know. I was aware of the tendency for the Honourable Member to go out of control since 1987. I went to the Prime Minister of Trinidad and Tobago in August 2003 as a Minister of Government in Trinidad and Tobago, a PMM Minister, and told him that there was bid rigging taking place in Udicott. What the Commission of Inquiry is looking at is ten times worse than what happened with Biako Airport. And it's even more brazen. A much-needed facelift for one of the Magnificent Seven, the Queen's Royal College at the Queen's Park, Savannah. It's coming at a cost of $44 million, but Works and Transport Minister Carl Mimbert underscores the importance of preserving historical architecture. So I went to Cabinet about a year ago and got Cabinet approval for the additional cost because this is such an important building to Trinidad and Tobago that we thought it necessary to take it right through to the end. So there are a lot of rooms that had to be completely um, rebuilt when initially the architect was of the view. They just needed, a, you know, some, a little bit of work. External historical specialists were flown in to remake the moulds of the ceiling. Classrooms were redone to their original 1904 look. The clock was also recommissioned to operate as it did more than a century ago. Minister Imbert says adjustments were also made to stop a pigeon infestation at the college. The new hall is now air-conditioned so that the previous problem of pigeon infestation will now be a thing of the past and pigeons do contribute significantly to damage to historical buildings. Education Minister Esther Lejar told the gathering of students, parents and teachers that the school environment and ambience impacts on how a child performs. There is a correlation between the quality of the infrastructure and student performance. In fact, research has shown that improvements in accommodation and the learning environment can impact student performance. For CNC3, I'm Kamal Georges. Have your case. Everybody has a chance to do it. But not like my good friend. The minute you oppose my good friend, Mr. Speaker, the minute you oppose my good friend, he gets very, very angry. And if you oppose him strongly, Mr. Speaker, he becomes a raging bull. And that is what this government is not prepared to act. That is what it was. We just were not prepared to accept that. If this country cannot call to order its prime minister and his cabinet, and his political party to say we are not accepting that, then God help us.